What's up, Stoners? Welcome to the local band Smoke Up. This actually been waking big for the day. Uh, we've got Faith in Vain with Forgetful Tendencies. Facebook.com slash Faith in Vain from Rockford, Illinois. And I actually just did one of their songs on Dirty Radio. And as I'm about to do their episode, um, your visual episode, coincidentally, in the mail, I get an awesome shirt and the whole album. So uh, it worked out well. So I asked the fellows if they wanted me to do a different song, and uh, Ginger said, go ahead and do track seven, Forgetful Tendencies. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do track seven, Forgetful Tendencies. Fucking the other track I did, which was uh, track five, This Is Personal, got like an 8.8, 8.9, I think, on Dirty Radio, which is a fucking excellent score. I think it won for the week, too, so cheers to them for that. First, let's do the sponsors. I feel a sneeze coming any second, by the way. Jason Trevino Tattoos, Boost AK Integra Products, Vape Out, look at it, Big Brain Apple Valley, use code LBS15, they'll take 15% off purchase right there in there. There it is. Youngblood Productions, text booking if you're in Van Southern California to 909-706-1985 for bigger and better shows, courtesy of Youngblood Productions. And Dirty Radio, the free, uncensored app that has three awesome stations that anyone can download. But as I mentioned earlier, I'm on there every Friday at 7 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, for about 20, 30 minutes, as a bunch of bands battle it out. We see it's the highest reviewed score. Faith and Bane won this week, and we're also going to do another Sunday forgetful tendencies. Spark it up, you got it. Here we go.
in vain, forgetful tendencies. Facebook.com slash Faith in Vain. I'm from Rockford, Illinois. I'm going to go 8.7 out of 10. <clears throat> awesome, awesome high scream. The song was not what I expected, too. I expected it to be like straight super heavy, and I like how it was different than the other track. It was a lot more not clean singing style, because it definitely had, you know, a lot of heaviness to it, but um, it just felt like a completely different record than This Is Personal, I think, that, than uh, the title track. That's why I think I liked it. Also, I'm looking at the back of your CD. Why is Forgetful Tendencies track 7 and 7's is track 8? Don't you think 7's should have been track 7? Just saying. But, uh, yeah, you guys are cool, man. Fucking... I like how the lyrics are all inside the album, too. A lot of people are cheap and just put one little fucking sleeve right there with some credit notes in the back, and then that's it. <clears throat> I like how you guys got the whole package going on on the CD. And the, the artwork and shit's cool. Um, 8.7 out of 10. Thank you, fellas. I appreciate the shirt. I appreciate the CD. I'm going to rock out to it. <coughs> but, yeah, I, I enjoyed it because... It doesn't need to be all the madness and all the metal, like crazy heavy and screaming the whole time. Uh, there's nothing wrong with that fucking, that's what metal is, that's what hardcore is, whatever, but I like how there was some good clean singing in this one, so 8.7 guys, appreciate it. Facebook.com slash local band, smoke off, interested in having your band or 420 product on the show for free promotion. Make sure you like the page though, watch the video at the very, very top, on the page first loads that video at the top. It'll explain everything, how to submit correctly and or skip the waiting list and or get an album or EP review done. Other than that, I'm on Instagram, message, YouTube, Twitter, and Snapchat. Thanks for waking up with me. Cheers and keep blazing. Peace.